Hello everyone, this is Al Red Sox fan and you're watching on Al Red Sox fan YouTube station and we are going to simulate a belt that we all want to see for real but we're not getting it soon enough. Gennady Golovkin versus Saul Canelo Alvarez. 12 rounds middleweights. So we will simulate this. We will enjoy the simulation. It's 12 rounds. I chose the Alamo Dome for the uh, bout. And here we go. Let's jump right into it. As you can see, it's going to be Gennady Golovkin versus Saul Alvarez. This is Al Red Sox fan. You're watching on Al Red Sox fan YouTube station. This is the fight the boxing world wants to see, and we have not been given it by the promoters, by the management, and I can even say maybe by the fighters. You think they'd want to fight each other. They'd probably make the most money that they've ever made. It'd be great for boxing. So I've decided with my What If Promotions to give myself and the boxing fans what they want. Triple G versus Canelo. And here we go. Hope everyone's doing well out there on this Saturday evening or Sunday morning, wherever you are in the world. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Please share. And subscribe and share your thoughts in the chat or below. Let's move on to continue here. Continue. Continue. This bout is going to be simulated by title bout boxing. I will not be picking any strategies for any of the fighters. Um, it's all going to be a simulation with my audio call. We're going to be using the corner view. And let's jump in. So this is 12 rounds, middleweights, Gennady Golovkin versus Saul Canelo Alvarez. And here we go with round one. And here's round one. The fighters go out and meet each other in the center of the ring. They fall into a clinch. The referee breaks them. Golovkin to the left. Alvarez to the right. Alvarez slides into a neutral corner. Golovkin throws the first punches but misses. Retaliation by Alvarez. Good countering combination. Scores some points there. Alvarez misses with a combination, and now Triple G retaliates here in round one of this huge bout. Minute 44 left. Both fighters feeling each other out right now. Still in the center of the ring. No action right now. Alvarez is trying to press the attack. Triple G launches a combination but misses. Good defense there by Canelo. Canelo hands up, pressing forward, trying to find his range. Both fighters trying to get in a rhythm here in round one. Under a minute to go. Canelo lets a combination go but misses. Good defense shown there by Triple G. Triple G counters with powerful shots. 30 seconds left to go here in round one. They fall into a clinch. Both fighters back to the center of the ring. 10, 15 seconds to go here. So far. Oh, good countering shots by Canelo. And there's the bell for round one. It was totally a feeling out process here in round one. I give that round to Triple G. Let's look at the unofficial scorecard here. Unofficially, they gave that round to Triple G. All right, so let's move on to round two here of 12. Here's round two. Both fighters get off the stool and they meet in the center of the ring. Once again, trying to find a rhythm here, feeling each other out. Canelo throws the first punches but misses. Oh, huge shot by Triple G. Alvarez appears to be staggered by that punch. Let's see if Triple G can capitalize here. He tries to follow up a good defense by Canelo. Canelo counters him with a 1-2. Triple G still pressing. Another good counter shots there by uh, Canelo Alvarez as he's trying to take the play away from Triple G here in round two. Oh, another good combination by Canelo Alvarez to the head and body. Golovkin looks troubled now. 
Can Canelo press the attack and take the advantage? Minute 20 left here in round two. Alvarez is stalking his opponent. Triple G is trying to circle away. Canelo throws another combination but misses. 50 seconds left here in round two. Another combination thrown by Canelo, but nothing lands. Oh, there's a good one, too, by Canelo. This has been an Alvarez round here. Round number two. Oh, he walked into a tremendous shot by Triple G, and down goes Canelo Alvarez. And here is the count. The count is at two, three, four. Can Alvarez get up? It's at five. Six. Alvarez is up at six. Alvarez appears to be trying to regain his feet. There's this eight count, and the action shall commence. Let's see if Triple G has enough time to try to finish off Canelo Alvarez here in round two. About ten seconds left in the round. Triple G, another tremendous shot. He is trying to finish off Canelo. Can Alvarez survive? And he does. Huge round for Triple G. What was a Canelo Alvarez round? And then he walked into a countering hard shots by Triple G. And down went Triple. I'm sorry, down went Canelo Alvarez. So Triple G wins that round 10 8. Wow. Wow. Let's go to the unofficial scorecard here. That was a 10-8 round for Triple G. And once again, before we start round three, that was a what was a big Canelo Alvarez round. Turned late in Triple G's favor as Canelo was pounding away on Triple G in round two, pressing the attack, had the total advantage, and he walked into a tremendous combination. Down he went for an eight count. He was up at six, but then he had to take the mandatory eight. So here we go to round number three. And round number three, as Triple G comes out to, uh, looks like he's going to fight on the outside and try to counter Canelo. Canelo is, looks like he's also going to fight on the outside, but press a little bit more. They fall into a clinch and they come out of the clinch. Canelo draws first blood here as he lands a good one, two, three combination on Triple G. Again, they fall into a clinch. They come out of the clinch. Both fighters looking to land shots here, but not really throwing right now. Triple G has not taken advantage of the knockdown in round two. Oh, good solid combination to the head by Triple G. Triple G tries to follow up once again with a one, two, but misses, and he's countered by Canelo Alvarez. Good countering combinations by Canelo Alvarez. Another good combination by Canelo Alvarez here. Minute to go here in round three. So far, it's been Canelo Alvarez. Another thudding combination. Triple G looks reels to the ropes. Can Canelo follow up? As he's following up with combinations to the head and body, nails him with an uppercut. But he has to be careful of that Triple G power as Canelo continues to press forward to take play away from Triple G. Oh, good solid shots there by both fighters. Alvarez got the better of that. Seven seconds left here to go in the round, and there's a round. Big comeback round for Canelo Alvarez. I give that round to Canelo Alvarez. He really needed that after losing a close first round and being knocked down in the second round. When he had the second round pretty much won, but walked into a thudding combination. It was a great comeback round for Canelo Alvarez here in round three. And let's look at the unofficial title bout scorecard. After three rounds, title bout has it. 29, Gennady Golovkin. 27, Saul Canelo Alvarez. Okay, let's move on to round number four. This is Al Red Sox fan, and you're watching on Al Red Sox fan YouTube station. The simulation of Gennady Golovkin and Saul Canelo Alvarez, 12 rounds, middleweights. The fight that we all eagerly await in real life. And here we go, round number four. So Triple G is going to fight on the inside, and so is Canelo Alvarez, they're going to be going head-to-head, -head, billy goat to billy goat. Triple G throws the first combination, but misses, and Canelo head and body lands as Canelo continues. Oh, good countering shots by Triple G as they stand toe-to-toe -to -toe in the center of the ring. 
Both fighters now fall into a clinch, and the referee breaks them. Two minutes left to go here in round four. Good shots by Canelo Alvarez. It's a very close round here as they're fighting hard on the inside, head-to-head, -head, billy goat to billy goat, trying to go to the head and body, both fighters. Canelo misses with those combinations. Countered by Triple G. Very close round here in round four. Minute 15 to go. They fall into a clinch. They come out of the clinch. Not a lot of action right now. Both fighters seem to be taking a bit of the round off. About a minute to go here in round four. Another good combination by Triple G as he's starting to take control of this round with under a minute to go. He misses with a combination. Good defense there by Canelo. Oh, fighting shots. Alvarez is badly hurt. 30 seconds left here in the round. Can Triple G follow up and take advantage of this situation? He misses there with a combination. 10, 15 seconds here to go in round four. Alvarez retreats to the corner, and he's nailed again by Triple G as the power is starting to show. And there is the bell. Oh, and right at the bell. Tremendous combination again. Big round for Triple G. He takes that round. So that's the end of round four. That was a huge Triple G round. Huge. Possibly a 10-8 round with no knockdown. But let's see how the title bout unofficial scorer has it. After four rounds, 39, Gennady Golovkin, 36, Saul Canelo Alvarez. Round four went to Triple G, 10-9. So, we're going to be coming up here on round five. You're watching on Al Red Sox Fan, and this is Al Red Sox Fan YouTube station. The simulation, 12 rounds, Gennady Golovkin versus Saul Canelo Alvarez, middleweights. The bout that the boxing world eagerly anticipates and hopefully will get in the near future. Until now, until then, I'm sorry, I've simulated the bout with my audio call. We move on to round five. And uh, Canelo is going to have to try to take the play away here from Gennady Golovkin. Here we go, round five. Both fighters, once again, will be fighting on the inside. I don't know if that's too smart for uh, Canelo as they fall into a clinch. He did not do well in round four fighting on the inside. No action so far. Canelo lands first blood again with a good one, two, three combination there. Let's see if he can keep up the work. Good defense by Canelo as he stays low. And Triple G misses with those punches. Oh, another good combination by Canelo Alvarez. Triple G was stunned by that. Let's see if Canelo can uh, take advantage here. Another good combination. He's letting his hands go, taking the play away from Triple G. But he has to watch out with that thudding power that Triple G has that dropped him in round two. He misses there with big shots. Canelo trying to follow up, but he's hit with a jab and a one-two by Triple G. A minute to go here, and so far it's been all Alvarez. Again, a good scoring combination by Canelo Alvarez. Under a minute to go as he's letting his hands fly freely, scoring at will now on Triple G. Missing with that combination. 30 seconds to go here in round five. So far, all Canelo Alvarez. Another good scoring combination by Canelo Alvarez as he is forcing the pace here on the inside, letting his hands go, smothering Triple G with punches. And there's the bell to end round five. Good comeback round by Canelo Alvarez. He needed that. Very big round for Canelo Alvarez. Let's look at the unofficial scorecard here. So they gave that round to Canelo Alvarez as I did. I, I am actually in agreement with this scorecard. Right now, after five rounds, Gennady Golovkin, 48. Saul Canelo Alvarez, 46. As we will approach the midway point of this fight, round six. Can Canelo Alvarez continue... With that furious pace he had in round five, fighting very well on the inside, letting his hands go, beating uh, Triple G to the punch, and smothering him when he wanted to punch. So, can Canelo Alvarez put together two rounds in a row now? He has not been able to do that so far. On to round six. 
Once again, both fighters are going to fight on the inside. And here we go, round six. Both fighters meet in the center of the ring. And again, Cano, that's out a tremendous combination. Golovkin seems in big trouble. Can Cano follow up? Another good combination by Canelo Alvarez. Again, he's on the inside. He is quicker. He is letting his hands go. Triple G right now has no answer for it. Oh, and down goes Triple G from fitting shots. Unbelievable. The count has reached one, two. Triple G trying to get back to his feet. The count is now at three. He is on his knees. It's at five, six. Seven. Triple G is yet to get up. Eight. Nine. He is up at the count of nine. He is in tremendous trouble. Can Canel Alvarez finish him off here in round number six? What a fight it's been so far. Oh, as Canelo continues to let his hands go, Triple G is dazed and stunned. Unbelievable fight. Unbelievable round six. What a comeback by Canelo Alvarez after being dropped in round two. As Canelo continues to let his hands go, Golovkin is in big trouble trying to hang on. A minute ten to go here in round six. The referee's looking in as Canelo continues to rain punches down. Golovkin is badly hurt. Oh, he's just catching everything. Golovkin is in a lot of world of hurt and trouble. He's taking big shot after big shot. And down goes Golovkin again the second time here in round number six. The count is up to two. He is still on his back. He is struggling to try to get up. He is lurching to his feet, but he stumbles back down to his knees. This could be all over, folks, here in round number six. The count has reached seven, eight, nine, ten. That is it. What a fight. What a comeback. Unbelievable. Saul Canelo Alvarez knocks out Gennady Golovkin. With 34 seconds remaining in round six, what a fight as he nailed him, dropped him. Oh, Canelo Alvarez here in round number six. Tremendous victory in this simulation of title bout. Unbelievable. What a simulation victory for Canelo Saul Alvarez. Three knockdowns in this fight. The first one scored by Triple G in round two. And then in round six, Canelo Alvarez scores a knockdown early. And then the knockout with 34 seconds left here in round six. And what was an un unbelievable, entertaining slugfest here at the Alamo Dome. So let's get the official announcement for this tremendous victory by Canelo Alvarez. And here is Michael Buffer with the call. Ladies and gentlemen, the end comes at 226 of round number six. The winner by knockout and middleweight champion Saul Canelo Alvarez, what an unbelievable bout, folks, in this first bout of a multiple bout simulation. Wow. Wow, that's all I can say. Let's continue on. The new middleweight champion, Saul Canelo Alvarez. Let's hit continue again. Let's update the records. So. That was a tremendous bout, and wow, a shocking finish. The winner by six-round knockout, Canelo Alvarez. This has been Al Red Sox fan. Thank you very much for joining me this evening. Hopefully you've enjoyed this simulation. There's going to be a few more simulations of this bout to see what happens. Once again, this is Al Red Sox Fan, and you're watching Al Red Sox Fan YouTube station. The winner in bout number one between Kennedy Golovkin and Saul Canelo Alvarez was Canelo Alvarez. KO round six. Unbelievable. Great fight. Both fighters were hurt. They were knocked down, scored by both fighters. And then 
The Knockout by Canelo Alvarez. Thank you very much. This is Al Red Sox fan. You've been watching on Al Red Sox fan YouTube station. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Please share. Please subscribe. And have comments. What are your thoughts on the real fight that hopefully we'll be seeing in the near future between Triple G and Canelo Alvarez? Thank you very much. Health and happiness. Have a great evening. Great day. Great morning. God bless.